what kind of cancer? If you don't mind me asking. Lung cancer, we got that cleared six years ago, and now we got the leukemia, mild form of cancer. Now I got an infection, um, a bladder, I got to go Thursday, an hour's deal at the hospital, then they put in a little thing with a little camera, and they scrape it off. You know. Really? Quite amazing what they can do. And so you're still busy working and doing all the extra? Yeah, well, I'm still busy, you know. I, uh, I'm just try to keep moving. I think that's the key. Of it. A lot of people, yeah, unfortunately, don't uh, when they retire. They. Uh, so nothing should hurt today, okay? So no. if anything's sensitive, you let me know. Yeah. Oh man, you're a tough guy though. You still loving the game of golf? Oh yeah, I do. And unfortunately, I don't get a chance to play, but I enjoy teaching too, so yeah. Right? So yes, gotta... yeah. How about that McElroy? Wasn't that some Oh show? yeah, that was crazy. That was phenomenal. I, I He's love my it. favorite. I, I love his swing. Yeah. He's yeah, so I think great tempo. He's looser now. He's freed up that swing. These guys better be careful now. He is so strong. Yeah, for a little guy. Eh? He loves Toronto. Toronto adopted him too as well. I've never, you know, I've played in three Canadian Opens over the years, and I've never heard a crowd applause a player like they did with McIlroy. You know, which is terrific. And then he's a basketball. Fan. Oh yeah, to see him with the jersey at the end was yeah. Yeah, it was a great show. I, I wasn't able to go out this year. No? No, it's I've been to two Canadian Opens. It's, it's it's amazing to see these guys in person. Well, next year you better go to St. George's. That's where I grew up. My, it used to be called Roy York. Yes. It's owned by the Roy York Hotel. So he'll be there. It's going to be in St. George's. It, wasn't that, is that rated like a top, top oh, course? Yeah, are you kidding? Yeah. Yeah. If you get a chance, you should get to play it. You know. How do you how do you feel when you still hit balls? Still feel good, uh, or is it tough now? Well, I, I don't hit as far as I used to. Yeah, so it's a different game, right? Yeah. New equipment today, it's everything's changed. But I uh, still enjoy going out. You know. What's the biggest thing you find with people's golf swings that they're having trouble with? Uh, you know the big thing that the pros fight on is, the, is grip pressure. See what happens when you grip it too tight with the left hand is you probably know your body tightens up, your backswing gets quick. So what the pros are, they try to loosen their grip before they go back. Really? It keeps the body loose, yeah. I gotta see it because... Well you got a good swing, you hit the ball pretty good. <laughs> but I'm not, well I'm not playing so it's not consistent, right? No, that's right, exactly. So. You're probably just missing the basics, that's all, you know. That's what I work on, the fundamentals, you right? The grip, the, the grip's number one, right? Most yes. important. Yes. And the posture, tempo. Tempo. It's just learning to control the swing, not trying to smash it, just swing. You know, look at that McElroy. He hit a drive in that first hole, I don't know if you saw it. It's, a, it's about as wide as this building, okay? Because I played there a few times over the years. He hits a 375. He's in front of the green. Chips. I, I saw that. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Okay, but the third day, hit the same drive. The guy he's playing with was not a short hitter. He's got him by 100 yards. He hit 17 the par five with a drive and a seven iron, longest drive of the week. Crazy. I mean, this guy is. He's smashing it. Will be 16 and 18 and shoot 61. I know, when I saw the 61, that's unbelievable. Yeah. Is this a little sore for you? No. Okay. So I'm gonna trim as much as I can first. Yeah. And then we're gonna file everything down smooth. All right, great. Mm -hmm. It's really hard for you to reach your feet, right? Have I burned? It's hard for you to reach your feet? Yeah. Well, from here, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So are you living close by or? Yeah, I'm, I'm living in Mississauga. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah, I don't want to be too far away. No, you're right, the commute. you're smart. So we're going to trim this one little by little. Yeah, because the stress is uh, 
the killer, right? Yeah, to think about having to drive, you know, 45 yeah. minutes an hour every single well, day. Look, is, look at these people that do drive from Hamilton. I know. So I'm in Mississauga. You're smart. This course is getting like a New York City. So are you okay? Yeah, oh yeah. They're building 10,000 new homes at Confederation and Bernathur. It's Rogers, you know, just uh, on the west, west there. Central Park, you know, Central, but Confederation on the south side and also on the north. So Rogers owns that land, so that's yep. where Hurts or yeah. just sensitive? No, no, it's fine. Did your mother play golf, Jonathan? No. No? But I was very smart and I got my wife into golf. Oh, yeah, and married. she likes I didn't it. Know when did you get married? Three years ago. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> good for you. Thank you. And she can outdrive my dad. No. <laughs> kidding. On and a your good dad's drive. getting to be a sport and I see him driving me a convertible. <laughs> That's his style, yeah. He, he likes that. That's good. Well, he's. Turning uh, 74 next week. No, is that right? Mm -hmm. How old do you think I am? Be nice. Oh. <laughs> Roy, I've been seeing you since I was a little kid. Yeah. Uh, and you look the exact same. I, I don't even know. I would say you're probably close to my dad's age. 84. Oh, jeez. 10 years on my dad. Wow, you, that's good. Yeah. You're He's looking good. Hanging in, you know. I'm, Dodging all the bullets. Looks like you don't need it. <laughs> no, TV no, show and no, no. Good. I'll take the look. Yeah, Matthew's been here for three months, and it's just too many people coming in. Yeah. And if they didn't have Matthew, like they'd be waiting too long and probably yeah. go somewhere else. So at least he helps keep me going. So he's and he's really good. Oh, that's great. But uh, yeah, this Thursday I was gonna do, but I gotta go in Thursday for that little. Uh, Bladder deal for an hour. Okay, so let me trim this other big one. You yeah. okay? Yeah. So what I would try to do is that we see each other just even once a year. Yeah. Would be a little bit better that way. Yeah, I will. You never have to worry too much. No, I'll do that. Give sure. you a peace of mind so you don't have to walk around because this can be painful, I'm sure. Were they bugging you in your shoes? No. Wow. Oh, well, just that one there that uh, I cracked was was up a little high, you know. But, uh, here, you know. So that's good. Your wife's helping you. That's good. Yeah, she she helps me out a good lot. for you. And you know when I go play golf on the weekends, she oh, loves yeah, the aggravation. Yeah. <laughs> she she she, she comes out with me and. So where do you go? Wherever we can. My friend has a um, Clublic membership, so I've oh, actually good. been following him around. Oh, good. But it can get pricey, so I like, you know, Golf Now. That Golf Now is amazing. Oh, yeah, there you uh, go. Golf Now is great. you got some great prices, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Golf great. is not like it used to be. No, you... no. Well, the great course you should, if you get a chance to play in Hamilton, it's called Kane's Forest, it's owned by the city. It's as good as any private course. Really? You test the golf, oh, yeah. Do they do a pretty good job maintaining it since it's a city oh, course? Oh yeah, oh yeah. You know, years ago when the Philippines started their golf tournament, I remember playing it and donating some prizes. I used to have it out at Glen Cedars up the East End, you know? You got one guy that's been coming to the range for 40 years. The Latino guy, Martin, says to me. Really? The guy looks about 30 years old. <laughs> Unbelievable. It's He's older than I am. It's those Asian genes. Yeah. Keep us hopefully looking young for a long time. Yeah. It's a Filipino friend of mine, he was 60, good shape, didn't smoke, didn't drink. Went, went for a checkup, had cancer, died two weeks later. Oh my gosh. Yeah, unbelievable. Yeah. So there you go. You never know what's around the corner, right, John? You know, and the scary part is you never know what's I inside. One day at a time. One hole at a time, right? That's it. You got it. Oh, I love there's that new book. I haven't read it, but I was reading a little few summaries called, you know, Every Shot Counts. Yeah. Right? You just focus on that one shot, nothing else. Second shot, the Hogan says is the most important part. Mm. 
was playing with Billy Casper in the Masters one year. Casper was known as a great putter. And he played 18, Hogan hit 18 green shots, 72 even par. Okay? Casper hit seven green shots, 68. So they're walking off the green near a hot dog stand. He said, a good thing you could putt, otherwise you'd be selling hot dogs. <laughs> That's what he said, huh? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> What did you think of Tiger Woods' win? Phenomenal. That's great for golf. And it's the same with McElroy. With McElroy winning, he needed him to win because he's got a little he, he's, per yep. personality. Young. He's young. young. Yep. And uh, he's great with the people. You know? He's yep. a billionaire almost today, believe it or not. Well, him. Because I know a lot of people that I teach are friends with his dad. You know? well, well, him and Nike, man. If you team oh. up with Nike. Unbelievable. But Tiger. Phenomenal, just unbelievable. To come back from well, all these. Well, the guy was lucky to play golf and he couldn't yeah. walk. Yep. He's had so many surgeries. Yeah. Crazy what happened to David Duvall. Oh, yeah, there's a, there's a real talent. He thinks. He was amazing. Yeah. I, I remember watching that million dollar match, how big of a deal it was for him against Tiger Woods. Yeah. And then after that, all divorce and that, and that's oh, it. Know, the, with the right woman, you can make your or break your, <laughs> right? Pretty couple, same way, he said. It's problems too, I think. The only good thing in that is they didn't have any children, so. Devel, uh, or Devel married that new gal, and she had a ready family already, so. It turned out good for him, so, which is great. So, your money's not everything, right? I no, no. Not healthy people, and it's, Tell you some stories. Money's not everything, huh? No. So the guy said, did you ever try going on a trip without it? <laughs> that, that's the problem, though. Yeah. But that's why my wife is Cuban. Oh, she's no kidding. And, uh... She's been living here quite a while? No, she? not just recently. Okay, well then, uh, she probably won't remember the Bacardi's. They came from Cuba. Yes. They're on, right? Yep. I teach the owner, the daughter, and her husband. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. And I got another lady, Filipino lady, believe it or not, who's a good friend of Fidel Castro's uh, brother. Oh. They play golf with them down when they go down there. Oh my god. So, you know, you, you meet a lot of interesting people. You do. You actually grew up in Cuba. No I'm kidding. But you learn, I learned a lot from that kind of life. I was there 64 years ago when it was wild. They had the casino going and everything. It's like a new world. You were there during that time? Yeah, I was. I was 20 years old. I was in Florida and we flew over. How I've always wanted to know how, how beautiful was that? What was it, it was like? It was gorgeous. They had the old beautiful old cars, downtown Cuba. They had the casino. All the movie stars used to go there. Wow. It was a happening place. Nice to see it happen again, you know. It's, uh... But I don't know, a lot has to change down there. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Beautiful, beautiful people, beautiful place. Yeah, I've met quite a few there, people from Cuba, actually. A lot of Canadians go down there, they love Canadians. Mm hmm. Right? Yep. Europeans, a lot of Europeans. So getting as much of this gunk out, trimming the bulk of it, and then we'll file everything down, okay? All right, great. And you'll be good for, you know, you can make it a year, six I'll months. Less, yeah, six months. Six months would be really good. Yeah, all right, I'll do six months. So is your dad playing much golf, or is he? He was, but he's going to be taking a little break for a little bit. Is he good? Yeah, just for his health and re relax a little bit, but then hopefully he'll be... Is he going to go away at all, or is he... He usually goes every winter for sure. Because, you know, here he can't play, but uh, no. goes down south. Good for him. But... Uh, he go to Florida? He goes to Cuba, if you believe it. No. I, mean, yeah. I don't blame him. The price is right. They yeah. got a couple of nice courses there. And then... Uh, but during here, he is... Playing in all over wherever he can. So what we're gonna do, Rui, is just file everything down. Alright. Make you a new man. So you should get all the new equipment, eh? Boy, this smash a lot of money. <laughs> I don't I don't think you we've ever used this before on you. No, we never have. 
the one that has the water on it. So you just relax the foot. You relax the foot. And so you're just gonna feel a little bit of cool water. So this is really gonna help you last a long time. The panties roots are still up now, they're used to get back. So it'll be down in a couple of years. They are, huh? Yeah. You know, it's very coarse, maybe it's laid out when you look at Branson. Yep. The old Phil Village shorts. The old Branson Bell shorts, it's still better. I think I played there once, yeah. but I can't remember the course though. Nice little course. You know that in uh, the Jubilee, there's more golfers playing golf now than hockey players. In golf. No. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's good for the sport. Yeah, it is. Great. This week we got the U.S. Open, right? So it should be up here. Oh yeah. And Tiger's playing in that one too, isn't he? He is. Yeah. Do you think he can ever beat the record? Yeah, I don't know. The guy is, uh, he's, I don't know if he's got, I, I can't say no because uh, what well, he's done to come back is phenomenal. Yeah, so. He stays healthy, I think he's got to try and stay fresh, right? Yep. Some of your business cards could go on the Oh, thank you. That oh, everything helps. Yeah. That, that'd be amazing. Thank you. A little old lady that came to the ocean, she said every little bit helps. <laughs> okay. Any pain here? No. So did you get away this winter? I guess not. Did you live with like, the TV? Uh, because my wife's in Cuba and her yeah. family's all there, we, we go back all day? every yeah. couple months. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You got brothers and sisters, I'm sure. Yeah. yeah. Okay, look at that. Terrific, I can't believe it. Looks good, huh? Yeah, it looks terrific. You're gonna teach right after this? I'm gonna go grab a sandwich and then I'll go down to teach. <laughs> nice. I don't live far from here anyways. That's good, so we're not that far. No, I live uh, just out of Central Park where Joan Drive, you know, Confederation, that area. Mm -hmm. What's your? Uh, Dundas and Cawthra area. Oh, Dundas and Cawthra, you look good, right near No Trail. Exactly. You know the best piece in Mississauga? No, where? Marconi's. Where's that? Cross and Dermatel. They were the first idea and they're still the best. Number one. Really? Yeah, really. And the best one, the best bakers, maybe. Nova Bakery, Burnsburg, and Cotter. Burnsburg, and that's where Marconi's is at five. Was the shop this good enough? Yep, I know, yep. I gotta check it out because I'm always, every now and then, at that Chopper Drug Mart. That's good. I'm gonna check out the bakery of Marconi. It's not that big. Yeah. And if you can drive it that far, huh? Yeah, seriously. Yeah. One set may try to end it up. But she's strong, right? The money I just built up there. Well, a good core, good leg. Yeah, that's right, exactly. That's, you got to move that car. Right? That's the amazing thing about golf. It's, you know, technique. You don't have to yeah. be the biggest. Yeah, right. Looks a little bit better, doesn't oh, it? Oh yeah, no, are you kidding? <laughs> Not the same action. <laughs>